Have you ever thought about starting your own business? Maybe you put some thought into it and said, I don't know if I wanna take the risk. Or perhaps you're afraid to go in on it alone. Well, here's the thing. You don't have to with Maryland Capital Enterprises or MCE. Nick Rudolph is the regional director and joins me this afternoon. Hi, Nick. Hi, how are you doing? I'm great. So just what is MCE and how did it get started? So we're a small nonprofit. We formed back in 1998, and our goal is really to help people start and grow their small businesses through technical assistance and access to capital. We're able to serve any small business on Maryland's eastern shore, Baltimore City, Baltimore County, or Anne Arundel County. So what kind of services do you provide? Sure. So we offer um, what's called mostly technical assistance, and that is working with businesses either one-on-one -on -one or in a classroom setting to get them the knowledge that they need to make sure that they're going to be successful, whether that's a how to start your business, how to use QuickBooks, how to plan for things like a pandemic, and how to adapt when something happens. But what most people are really interested in is that we offer access to capital. We are an SBA lender, and we're able to offer some money to small businesses and then also work with other banks and other nonprofits if a need is bigger to get um, what the small business needs. And now with COVID-19, you are offering services to help businesses with that? Absolutely. Yeah, we've been very lucky to receive a, a number of grants to offer technical assistance specifically for COVID-19. So we've got webinars on topics like how to um, renegotiate leases and contracts now that we're under COVID-19, how to turn a storefront business into more online type businesses, and how to use social media to advertise in a time when you're not out there in your customers' faces. Very interesting. Now, you mentioned grants. Yes. You have a grant right now, but time's running out. That is right. Um, we have a $5,000 grant that was provided by Wells Fargo that we have 40 of them open to small businesses in our entire service area. And all you need to do is apply by 4 p.m. on Friday the 22nd. That's tomorrow. That is tomorrow. Okay. It's a very simple application though. That's wonderful. Yes. And you have information on how to get that application. I also want to talk about uh, MCE is also home to an SBA Women's Business Center. Yes. That sounds interesting. We are very lucky that the SBA has chosen us to run a Women's Business Center. And really what it does is it offers us more resources to provide technical assistance to women and minority-owned businesses. So we're able to do, of course, when it's safe, in-person classes and offer just a little bit augmented uh, technical assistance uh, to clients who come through the Women's Business Center. So a lot of support every step along the way? Absolutely. Every from, from what is my business idea, how to write a business plan, how to figure out if it's going to make money, and then how to look for hurdles once you've, once you're open so that you're ready to jump over them and, and, and surpass them. Typically you hold an annual women's business conference. Is that going to happen this year? Well, as of right now, we had to postpone it. It was normally going to be held in April. We are hoping that once this pandemic subsides, that we'll be able to um, host it later on in the fall. But even if we're not able to do something um, in person, we'll be able to have some sort of event online line for folks. Maryland Capital Enterprises, it sounds like you have so much to offer for uh, our small business uh, owners. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. And it's, and it's not just the technical assistance and money, it's also networking, getting to know other people who are doing exactly what you're doing. Um, it gives you an opportunity to build a community and really that's what small businesses do, they build communities. Absolutely. Nick Rudolph, thank you so much. Thank you. And of course there's so much more information, but you have to go to our website to get a link to MCE's website to find that information. That's also where you can find information on how to get in on that $5,000 grant. Remember, the deadline is tomorrow.